Basketball has opened up a lot of doors and broadened my horizons in ways I never would have imagined. Everything I do revolves around helping kids, try to use sports as a tool to continue their education, get out and broaden their horizons. Basketball was my first love and still is. Harrington, a Chicago Hoops standout and former coach at Marshall High School, appeared in the 90s basketball doc Hoop Dreams. When you're coaching in Chicago Public League, you're doing just as much parenting as you are coaching. It was nothing out of the ordinary to drop kids off at home, give them a couple of dollars to get them something to eat. This was just a regular day on my way to work and dropping off to school. Two kids down the corner, that same age kids that I work with every day, mistake my car for someone else's car and me and my daughter just became under fire by a barrage of bullets. At that point in that time, it was just about protecting my daughter. The fact that she was able to walk away from that car without a scratch on her body. I would do it all over again. The love and support that I got from North, West, South, East side of Chicago, I had a great support system on this journey that I'm still on. Back on the court for the first time since he was left paralyzed by a shooting. Sean Harrington feels at peace at Children of Peace Catholic School. Teaching pre-K to eighth grade, it's been a blessing. They've been as much as a blessing to me as I've been to them. If they're surprised by the fact, hey, there's a guy in a wheelchair that can teach me how to play basketball, I'm, I'm fine with that. Every time I see one of these kids shoot a jump shot and it goes in, I felt like I shot it. I'm having fun playing these games that I played growing up with these kids and teaching them life lessons, along with just having fun in gym, teaching them how to be, how to be a good classmate, how to be a good friend, how to apologize when you're wrong, when you made a mistake. And it's okay to make a mistake, no one's perfect. They say behind every door there's an opportunity. You've always heard teachers tell you that education is the key. So I like to put those together and say that education is the key to open up the doors of opportunity.